It's the room furthest from your heater and always remains colder than the rest of the house in the winter. Unfortunately, to raise the temperature in there requires either a larger heating system or the use of portable electric heaters. Meet Kelly, who has her master bedroom at the far end of the house and hasn't been able to keep the room's temperature at a comfortable level. So this is my bedroom. Uh, it's my favorite room in the house. I love all of the windows and I love the attached bathroom. Uh, one thing I don't love though is uh, it's very hard to keep the temperature consistent in here. It's the farthest room from the furnace, um, which is a problem for a lot of people when it comes to heating and cooling. Um, in the summertime here in Michigan, it gets extremely hot. And in the wintertime, it gets extremely cold. And it's my bedroom. It should be my personal haven and <laughs> we need to fix this problem quickly. Think Green visited Kelly's home with Russ Camferman, who works with TPI Corporation, one of the largest and oldest electric heating manufacturers in the U.S. Our purpose? To install a unique solution to home heat distribution that is effective and economical. Okay, so this is the problem room. All right, I can see why. Lots of glass, three exterior walls, and a tall ceiling, and it's a long ways away from the thermostat. We have a product here called the Hot Pod, and this is going to help resolve that problem. It installs right into the existing ductwork, so the only thing different you're going to see in this room is going to be the thermostat that controls it and potentially save you up to 15% on your energy costs. Wow. Because it's going to allow you to reduce the temperature in the wintertime of the rest of the house, give you full control of this room, and you know allow you to put more heat in here so that you don't have to heat the house so high and do the same thing in the summertime with the cooling as well. It's gonna bring more cooling from the rest of the house in here. Now, you said it's gonna have its own thermostat. Is that gonna be up upstairs, downstairs? Right be... here in this room. Oh, yep. okay, So you'll have Great. full control of this room. So okay. is it noisy? Is it, it is not, that's the beauty of this. It's very quiet. Uh, you should hear no, you know, very little noise. You know, extremely quiet. So is this something that I can do myself or? You know, for a handy person, I don't know if you are, but if you were, you could install it yourself. Uh, but we do recommend having a professional install it for you. All right, here we have your wireless thermostat that controls your hot pod. It gives you the option of having it here on the nightstand next to the bed or we can bring it here and mount it on the wall and make it more permanent. Oh, great. All right, well now that we've finished the installation, we're ready to start your savings and make this room much more comfortable for you. Awesome, that sounds great. You know, it was so easy, I'm thinking about, maybe why don't we put one in my bathroom? Well, and we can do that for you. I could not be more satisfied with the hot pod since we installed it into the house last week. It's been the most comfortable five nights of sleep that my husband or myself have got all summer. And I'm certainly looking forward to my next energy bill as well as I am certain that we are saving a lot of money and uh, being more comfortable in my favorite room of the house. For more information on the Hot Pod inline duct heater, go to hotpod1.com. Be sure to visit designingspaces.tv where you can see this portion of the show again and find a link to their website. You can visit these websites to learn more about the participants on this edition of Designing Spaces.